name is Michael Foss. I'm president of IISE, and I work in logistics optimization with Amazon. How many IIE annual conferences have you attended? <laughs> That's a great question. I don't, actually can't. I don't have them added up, but uh, I have attended several over many years. What do you enjoy most every year coming to this conference? That's another great question. I enjoy many parts of it. Uh, the awards banquet is always very special just to see what great accomplishments uh, industrial and systems engineers have accomplished uh, throughout their career. Uh, but I also enjoy the keynote speakers. We've been able to get some really talented people to come in and share their story. Um, and then the networking alone is just really invaluable. Uh, there's plenty of planned opportunities for uh, engineers and students and young professionals to get together and talk and really share experiences. It's a great time. What do you hope to take away, even though you've been to all of these conferences over many years, what do you hope to take away from this conference? Well, this is certainly a special conference for me being president, so my takeaway is to really enjoy every minute. I know this is a fleeting moment, uh, but it's a really special uh, moment for me, uh, and I'm truly honored to be uh, voted in as the, the president for the entire organization. So I'm just truly enjoying every moment of it. I'm Don Green. I'm the executive director of the Institute of Industrial and Systems Engineers. And it's going to take a while to get used to saying that, but it sure sounds good. Our association, like our profession, is all about change. From the days of the Gilberts and Taylor through the manufacturing advancements of the 50s and beyond, to improving healthcare, retail, and much more to leading the data analytics movement, to designing and improving large, widespread systems. We've always been growing and improving. And that's what this is about as well. This change allows us to better reflect the expanded scope of our profession, to encompass what we do, and to appeal to today's, as well as tomorrow's, industrial and systems engineers. Now, as always, it's an exciting time to be an IE. As Dr. Gilbert said, our quest continues. Supply chain is really a success story for our field. I think um, really supply chain today is a big driver of, of changes in the world and, and a lot of it is because of what we do in this field. We believe that this 2016 conference has delivered the important tools and information needed to perform every sort of job better, faster, and more effectively 
both now and in the future. I'd like to utilize the time allocated for my keynote address to focus on a very specific aspect of that last statement. That is the tools that lead to significant improvement of productivity, quality, reliability, and safety. If you believe, as I do, that industrial engineers are both educated and trained to introduce and help to operationalize all the tools that can make jobs, products, and services more effective and efficient, then we're all in the right place. Is this your first IIE annual conference? This is my fifth conference, third in a row. Why do you keep coming to this conference? Um, I keep coming. Um, I mean, number one is networking. So I just love being able to come and see people, meet people, um, and then every year I come back and get to see them again. Um, we've been fortunate enough to have a group of students come every year from Northeastern, which is awesome. Um, and it's just, a, it, for me, because I don't do traditional IE every day. It just helps me with my own professional development to kind of stay current. All right. Uh, is there a particular event at this conference you look forward to every time you come? Um, I feel like it's not necessarily an event, but just the impromptu social events and, and networking. I think, you know, I love going to the sessions. I'm, you know, I've been going to a lot of the YP and industry advisory board sessions, so I love going to those. Um, but a lot of times it's just those kind of outside the session conversations that I just, you learn a lot about yourself and about the profession that I look forward to. I'm Carl Kerpus. People remember my last name, Kerpus with a Purpose. I'm from uh, Genesis. We're an engineering design build company. And I'm the vice president of operations. Uh, is this your first IIE annual conference? This is not my first conference. I've been going to, uh, this is my fourth conference now. Uh, well, what keeps you coming back then every year? I really enjoy uh, the opportunity to collaborate with a diverse group of colleagues from across the industry who all have a like mindset in terms of industrial and systems engineering, being able to hear uh, the topics that are at the top of their minds and uh, take some of that away and apply it back uh, to my organization is really neat. Uh, do you have a favorite event, uh, whether it be specifically for this year or just every year at the conference? Well, really the first event that um, I became even more engaged uh, with the Institute was the IAB Town Hall. I had the opportunity to join the Honors and Awards Committee there, and then most recently I just took on the uh, role as the IAB Chair. And so for me, I'd have to say that's probably my uh, favorite event so far, just because of the engagement that it created. And overall, what are you hoping to take away from this conference? Um, overall, I really enjoy um, taking the lessons uh, that I learn and the new ideas that are out there and being able to uh, share those back with the uh, colleagues that I have in, at my organization as well as be a part of a group of individuals who are working to really transform industry uh, through the Institute and through industrial and systems engineering. So we'll expect to see you again next year for your fifth conference. Yes, I'll be there. Thanks.